Hi, I'm Essie and these are some outfit ideas inspired by Pinterest. So let's start off with jeans. I like to start with a basic outfit and then kind of build it up. So here I am just wearing a basic white tee and then I am putting on this vest. And vests have become very popular lately, a lot thanks to Tyler, the creator. And I also just wanted to say that I know that this video might be a little bit bad timing because of the whole self-isolation. But I think the one thing that you can do while you're in quarantine is just to go through your closet and try on some different outfits. So yeah, another thing I've been loving lately is just these basic zip-up hoodies and especially this grey one. If you live in a bit of a colder country like I do, you can just layer it with a puffer. And this outfit is pretty baggy, but sometimes you want your fit to be a bit tighter, so then you can just wear a tank top, for example. And turtlenecks is another great thing, but they can be a little bit warm for the spring and the summer. So it's very convenient to have this sleeveless one. Turtlenecks are great for layering, so here I'm just layering it with this plaid sweater. And these kind of like grandpa size have become very popular, especially on Pinterest. Now on to white jeans, so once again I'm just wearing a very basic outfit with this white tank top. But then to build it up I'm just adding this purple fur tank top and also some platform boots. And this is one of my favorite items at the moment, it's this beige cable knitted cardigan and I'm just wearing it with this fake Prada bag. So this is once again a basic outfit with this black tank top, but then I am putting on this very cool grey jacket that I absolutely love. Let's switch up the jeans to these Levi's jeans and I'm just wearing them with this flowery tank top. And now I'm putting on my yellow furry cardigan and I just think that these pastel colors are so nice. But if you want to make the outfit more relaxed and comfortable, you can just add this zip up hoodie once again. If you go on Pinterest, you will definitely see suit pants, and it can be hard to make them not look classy or like chic. So what I like to do is just to add oversized blazers, and they are still like classy, but not in a bad way, you know. This Mia Wallace outfit is already very iconic, but if you want to build it up a little bit, a great thing is to add one of these very big sweaters. But if it's warmer out, you might want to wear a tank top instead, and then I'm just adding this bag. I'm a bit obsessed with these pants, but they are extremely big, so they can be a little bit hard to style. But I actually think that they go along with everything, both tight tops and bigger tops. I've been seeing these zebra pants all over my Pinterest and since they are a bit out there, I just like to wear them with white tops. A great tip to make the outfit go together is to match the top and the bottom. So you try to only wear things that are in the same color palette. So here the palette is just black and white, so I like to wear either black, white or grey. oversized tees like 95% of my time 
and they are very easy to style so you can both style them with bigger pants or tighter pants. And here I'm just wearing them with these bike shorts. The best way to be as comfortable as possible is just to wear sweatpants. But if you don't want to look like you're just wearing your pajamas, you can dress them up. I like to match my sweatpants with my top. So here I'm just matching them with this zip up hoodie again. But you can also just wear a sweater or a t-shirt or whatever you want that's in the same color as the sweatpants. That way the outfit looks more put together. Then I'm just styling the sweatpants with tank tops and then I'm adding this zebra bag. This spring and summer I am definitely going to wear a lot of skirts, both long ones and short ones. I like to style long skirts with platform boots, but if you don't have any or you don't feel comfortable in them, you can just wear them with normal sneakers or whatever you want. And now I'm just putting on this blue furry cardigan. If it's a bit chill outside, you can just wear whatever jacket you want. So here I'm putting on this puffer again. Now onto shorter skirts. As you might have noticed, I really like cardigans and I see them all over my Pinterest. As I said before about the color palettes, a great way to make your outfit feel more put together is just by matching the top and the bottoms. In this outfit there's a bit of yellow in my skirt, so then I'm putting on my yellow cardigan. Here is a tie top. And I think the tie tops are very nice with these short skirts as well. And here is just a basic white cardigan. And here is another short skirt that I really like. And once again I'm just putting on this yellow cardigan. Now I'm putting on this plaid blazer and I really like this blazer over skirts and dresses look. The last item that I'm going to style is dresses. So first I'm putting on this white cardigan over the dress and it makes it kind of look like a skirt. And now I'm putting on this white tie top over the dress and I really like this look. And the last way to style the dress is just by putting on a blazer over the dress. Mm -hmm. 
So those were some of my favorite outfit ideas inspired by Pinterest. And I hope that you got a little bit inspired and I will see you in my next video. Goodbye!